Did you know that the Philippines is a typhoon country that deals with 20 typhoons per year on average? The number of typhoons is said to increase as the issue brought about the climate change become more pronounced. Here are some precautionary measures before, during, and after a typhoon. What to do before a typhoon? Keep yourself updated. Watch news on TV or radio. Next, check house condition and make necessary repairs. Store sufficient ready to eat food and water. Make sure the food and water supply are enough to last for a few days. Prepare and keep emergency kits that contains first aids, flashlights, candles, batteries, and live vests. Please make sure to charge our cell phone and save all the important emergency numbers. If you are advised to evacuate, please do so. These people, LGU or Barangay officials, who will inform you of the need for evacuation are more knowledgeable than anyone else. What to do during a typhoon? During a typhoon, listen to weather updates. If possible, stay alert for any sign of change in your areas and do the following. Remain calm and stay safe inside the house or evacuation center. Turn off main switch for utilities like water and electricity. Prepare a flashlight or lamp in case of emergency or power outage. Keep away from possible danger like glass windows. Avoid going along flooded areas to avoid getting waterborne diseases. What to do after a typhoon? Stay indoors even when the typhoon is over. Go out only when advised by LGUs, the barangay officials, or pag-asa. Keep away from danger such as structures, damages, falling trees, and damaged power line. Check for wet or submerged outlets or appliances. We cannot stop the natural disasters, but we can arm ourselves with knowledge. So many lives would have to be lost if there was enough disaster preparedness. So, thank you for listening and have a good day!